What's up everybody, it's Conger Live. We're back again with another DC Worlds Collide video. In today's video, we're gonna be going into the character trials for Constantine, talking about the new requirements for the hero trials. If you're new to the channel, Ninja Kick the like button, subscribe for more content, and let's go check it out. You see, you scroll over to adventure, and there are the trials in the top right. Uh, I have also recently unlocked Dr. Luther. We'll be doing his trial in another video. Uh, but we have Constantine's trials unlocked. Now, I was also able to obtain Gorilla Grodd, but unlocks when this character reaches rank 5. So even though I have the character, you have to get him to rank 5 to now access their trials. Um, the first one is Circle of Sacrifice. Arcane Aid, Foresight, Ultimate Trial 1 and 2. Um, so we're going to go ahead and start the first trial. Constantine is a great hero. He sacrifices 20% of his current HP to burn a giant magic circle onto the ground, which deals magic power equal to 205% of attack power to all enemies and dispels one buff. This skill also gains 10% lifesteal. So he can get a lot of that hit points back. So he's sacrificing some hit points in order to clear buffs. His ultimate can deal a large amount of damage to all enemies and grants lifesteal. So we're going to go ahead and put some tanks up in here to make sure he stays alive. Oh, it's at one speed. Let's give it 3x. Let's make this faster. And his ult... Eliminates the whole back line in this trial, and then some basics to finish it off. Oh, he gets, he gets to go again. There it is. So the trials are fairly easy at first because they're basically teaching you about the character's skills and such. Uh, the second one uh, highlights his skill where when a round ends, a magic circle is drawn beneath Constantine's feet. He completes one of three of the magic circle each time. After the magic circle is complete, it transforms into three magic protect projectiles, each attacking a random enemy target and dealing power damage equal to 85% of attack power. So he gets three little magic missiles for 85% of attack power after he gets three turns, basically. Uh, once again, we want to put up the tanks. Uh, the, the blue tank over there. And we'll go. So there's the first one. There's the second one. You can see it as it completes. He's going to use his ult, get some damage out there, some lifesteal. So even though he sacrificed 20% of his health, he gained almost all of it back, basically all of it back with the lifesteal. So definitely more useful, his ult, um, when there's more enemies on the board. And then he got to use those magic missiles after his third turn. Uh, helping to finish things off. His Foresight ability. At the start of an ally's round, they lose 15% of their current hit points and gain one stack of strong attack and two stacks of recover for two rounds. If triggered at a hit point lower than 60%, they additionally gain one stack of strong attack for one round. If triggered at hit point lower than 40%, they additionally gain one stack of shelter for one round. So it's going to help them do more damage and stay alive a little bit longer. Um, so he kind of plays with losing life and gaining it back for both himself and his team. I, I doubt these guys are going to get their uh, ults up, but we want to use the attackers first just in case. So you see the, the blue recover and the attack up, the strong attack uh, icons above each of the heroes. This is from Constantine's passive. Helping to eliminate everybody. So it's going to help your team do more damage and hopefully stay alive. So now we have our ultimate trial one and two where we have to use what we've learned to beat the challenges. You get an array of heroes to help you out with this. 
I'm uh, definitely gonna put Rillard Rod up front. Guess. Zatanna. This is basically the best chance we have. Now there's a lot of blue. Green Arrow does awesome, so we're gonna have him go first. Um, I also like Wonder Woman's attack. Zatanna does help out. Ah, I guess that's all right. Let's change our formation just a little bit. Put Wonder Woman across from the red, although. Yeah, that's fine. Constantine has a damage to all characteristics, so he can activate Green Arrow's tactical response. Ooh. Okay, yes, here we go. The, the damage to all. The AoE, basically. Uh, the, the three of them, Wonder Woman, Constantine, and Green Arrow. Green Arrow gets his the tactical response and then Wonder Woman gives out the crit chance Green Arrow has high crit chance so that's why we're utilizing him first for this challenge he's going to put in a lot more work than Constantine and the final trial ultimate 2 Probably going to do basically the same thing. Uh, we have different uh, heroes to choose from. Okay. Constantine has sacrifice characteristics, so he can activate Pandora's tactical resonance. Okay, so this is about keying into Pandora. So we'll definitely use uh, Stranger. I'm definitely going to want to use Pandora. I guess we'll use both the tanks. We'll use. So. Uh, Dr. Fate and Constantine are kind of like replacements for each other, generally. Um, and I think this is how I'm going to do it. Let me just make sure my formation is how I want it. Yeah. Uh, should Dr. Fate be up front? Should I drop one of the, ta the tanks? Dr. Fate up front. And add Zatanna. Try it. Most of these challenges are fairly easy in general. Um, we'll see if this is going to work for us or not. Well, we've gotten rid of their first frontliner. Should I maybe have put Pandora's? No. We want the blue guys doing their attack. Yeah, and Phantom Stranger. Oh, yeah. Dr. Fate's ult video. Beautiful. Love the animations in this game. Very, very nice. So we got it done. Pretty easy. Um, you should be able to complete this on your own when you have Constantine at level 5. Uh, for his new hero trial. Um, definitely do the hero trials as fast as possible because um, especially right here you're getting these uh, help you unlock more slots in your reserve center and of course the tokens the fragments help you rank your character up. Thank you guys so much for watching Ninja Kick the like button for more content and thanks again. We'll see you in the next video.